Okay, back onto the GPS navigation unit console. I should have picked a day that I wasn't hung over to do this. I apologise for the lack of enthusiasm, guy. I was just launching the software. So, I go 8 is basically what I'm loading up. So, I've got the R17 Aussie maps. Works pretty well. At the moment, I've got the daytime screen. So I'm going to try and zoom into to get a little bit more detail. Okay. I go as a pretty good software. In my opinion it's far better than TomTom and Garmin. Um, it's a shame that it is mostly a European based sort of map system but there are plenty of things out there for you to find them online so just I'm pretty sure as I go 8.3 something so it shouldn't be too hard to find. Pretty easy thing to do. We're just going to look search for a POI um, around my GPS position just looking for a service station petrol station there it is BP my fuel of choice so you're basically getting a bit of a revelation of my position there guys I don't care again I'm go over fuck it alright back into the map this is a pretty comprehensive GPS software. Quite easy to navigate around just by dragging just like any GPS on a unit like that. Things that you can't really do on a lot of those GPS's that people are putting on suction caps on their windscreens. You might not be able to see too well on the screen just because of the quality of the video but it does have 3D functions. You can customize a lot of the um, a lot of what you can do with the software as well. map is flipped around the wrong way. Interesting. <laughs> there you go. Shima can't put it into my mode. Leave it at that. 